So what kind of pizza do you like? My favorite pizza is actually white pizza, and I get attacked by people saying that's very simple, but it tastes good. Why ruin it? Is white pizza real pizza? Yes, to me it is. To you it is. Yeah. Um, is it real pizza? Yeah, yeah, we, real. we have an Italian on set, so. I like a white um, Like if I went to, to Naples, would I get a white pizza? I think so. Yeah. All right. Yeah, Rome has a white pie that's really good. So you've you've been at this this game for a while, and and now you're you're talking to moms and and their kids. But um, the the overall environment are, are you positive or negative? Because if if you spend too much time on social media like I do, you might walk away with the impression that that things are going to hell in a handbasket, and that nobody gets liberty anymore, and that that um, sort of this 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 strange new authoritarianism is is rising up. Um, what's your what's your take and 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 how do we how do we make sure the good guys keep moving in the right direction uh social media can be very very bad for your mental health i know this personally uh new fear cells so all these news people even twitter people they're talking about fear and trying to scare the crap out of you and to give you more government control but when you look at it by every measure humans are doing better than ever before we're the healthiest wealthiest this is the most peaceful time in human history so i think focusing on that is really good for your mental health and it's true also this book i've had a lot of parents come to me and say you know we need more stuff like this and i think there's more books out there and more educational opportunities so yes you you know, I know it can be hard to be positive, but I try to be positive on the outlook. My my biggest um, dislike on social media is clickbait. I feel like clickbait is the bane of of our human existence, and um, it's a little bit tougher to get to tell that positive story, isn't it? Like, do you get a lot of clicks saying, "By the way, guys, everything's okay. Exactly. Fewer people are poor. More." Fewer people are are starving. More people have more opportunities, and that's sort of in the trajectory from from the industrial revolution is 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 quite profound. But people don't really believe that, do they? It's hard because sensationalism and fear all that sells very well. Even for me, I know if I put out a negative video, it's going to get a lot more clicks than a positive video. That's yeah. where I've tried to over the past couple months really focus on the positive because I think there's so much anxiety, especially among millennials. Mm -hmm. Depression and anxiety. People are so scared of climate change right now, and we're all going to die in 12 years, and that's not the truth. So I'm really trying to change people's perspective because all this anxiety is really bad for our country we see all these mass shootings and stuff and i think one of the reasons is news media selling us this anxiety instead of the true story so i'm trying to change the change the narrative there